श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा गुरु ब्रह्मा गुरु विष्णु गुरु देवो महेश्वर गुरु साक्षात परम ब्रह्म तस्मै श्री गुरवे नम तस्मै श्री गुरवे देहान सकल नाम रूपात्मकेशु वस्तुषु अर्पधारादिषु रज्जुमिव व्या सच्चिदानंदलक्षणो परमात्मा स एव परशब्दे न उच्यते अहमादी दृश्य विलक्षण अस्मत्तय आलंबन भूता प्रत्यक्षिमात्रस्वूपात्मावरशब्देन उच्य परावर प्रत्यक अभिन्न परमात्मा तस्वीश परूपेण अवरूपेण चवस्थिते परावर विभागरहिते प्रत्यक अभिन्ने बरावरे ब्रह्मणे अहमस्मी भगवो देवते अहम वै तमसी श्रुतुसारेण अहम ब्रह्मास्मी ब्रह्म एव अहमस्मी व्यतिहारेण अखंडक साक्षात्ते सती परावर ब्रह्म साक्षात्ण परावर ब्रह्म साक्षात्त मम हृदय ग्रंथी भेद संशय निवृत्ति सर्वकर्म क्षय रूप परम पुरुषार्थ सम्यक आविर्भूया देहा गलिते विज्ञाते परमात्मने यत्र यत्र मनो याति तत्र तत्र सवार विद्यते हृदय ग्रंथि छिद्यंते सर्व संशया क्षीयंते चास्य कर्माणि तस्मिन दृष्टे परावरे दीज आर द टू उपनिषदिक मंत्र दे आर बीइंग इंडिकेटेड इन दी स्टेटमेंट तस्मिन दृष्टे परावरे तो व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ पर एंड अवर This is what is mentioned here. Dehat bahi hi sakal nama rupaatma keshu vastushu sarpadhara dishu rajju iva vyapta ha sachida ananda lakshana ha yaha paramatma sa eva parasabde na uchchate. Dehat bahi that which is other than us. Sakal nama rupaatma keshu vastushu all the things. Which are indicated 
by names and the forms sarpa dhara dishu rajju iva vyaptah unless the snake and the rope comes we cannot go ahead mm -hmm. you may not know brahman but you have to know the snake and the rope so sarpa dhara dishu rajju iva vyaptah when the rope is not recognized as rope it is mistaken as the snake or a crack in the soil or a hose pipe or a dry garland aadi etc vastu shu sarpa dhara dishu rajju iv so the rajju the rope is in and through all the superimpositions <coughs> now the question is when we have seen the snake and we are afraid so we want to go and kill the snake so we go with the torch means proper means of knowledge when you are coming in a little darker time and we step on the rope and we thought it is a snake so we go fetch a torch the torch is the proper means of knowledge what we have done we have stepped on the rope and that became the means of knowledge for us so it was a wrong means of knowledge cannot give you the right knowledge then we take the right means of knowledge so we take the torch and we take a stick to kill the snake we don't go in search of a rope and after the proper means of knowledge the torch is focus on the snake a rope is see after that has happened will we continue our inquiry is good it is a rope but where the snake has gone <coughs> we won't continue see? when the truth is revealed all unwanted questions disappear so dehan vahi sakala nama rupatmakeshu vastushu like the rope permeates in all the superimposed snake etc in the same manner sachida lakshano yaha parmatma sa eva para shabdena uchyate so in the example of the snake and the rope rope is the para in case of this world parmatma is the para shabdena uchyate so he who has recognized the substratum of this illusory world as parmatma will he ever be trying to improve the illusions this should be very clear in our mind social work is not spiritual practice we keep the cow in our house or in the farm for what for milk or for gobar cow dung no cow is kept for the milk cow dung comes free in the same manner our spiritual practice is to discover the truth atma rupena as a result of which if others are benefited cow dung will we be boasting about our cattle do you know my cattle gives tons of gobar <laughs> tons of cow dung no we boast about how much milk that cow has given in the same manner unless we recognize this see friends the whole problem is here unless we recognize the world as an appearance on the substratum of the reality we will keep ourselves engaged in this world through lots and lots of activities there was a saint in bombay 
his name was there is humming coming in the mind so what happened to me <laughs> he went there he came to krishna <laughs> so that saint was belonging to the caste of ambedkar what we call scheduled caste so he thought let me teach my people cleanliness so he used to put on all kinds of funny dresses not the clean clothes properly are in no the night pajamas those days that you know strip type and the, uh, somebody has thrown the shoes pt shoes he put on the pt shoes torn socks and some kind of funny cloth around his uh, face and one um, clay pot on his head and tie it down and that was used for everything for taking food for going to bathroom for washing everything only that pot so he was called as potty man in the local language is called as gadge baba now he thought let me teach these people something systematic in life their life is so mess so wherever there is to be gatherings of so many people yatra or some function celebrations So he used to go early, clean that whole big ground with a jhado in his hand, and mark properly with the white chalk. This area are ladies. This area is gents. Here the shopping. Here the parking of the vehicles. All kinds of things. Idea was people should learn. He continued for few years, ten, fifteen, twenty years. He continued. then what started happening wherever there is any function people is to say oh he has not come now who will do it <laughs> his idea was to teach them and people have taken unless he comes who will do it see so he got frustrated and that may becomes a frustration when we try to improve others see therefore here this world is rajju eva vyapta ha sarpa daradishu this world if we take real we start working on the world to improve the world see what is to be done with this world one person asked me this question swami ji why don't you start some project i said no i am lazy i am nalayak layak people can do it i can't do it see have i created this world no why should i improve this world who has created he will take care another person swami ji you should start some schools i said why should i i don't want to start any school no 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 many marpa has started a school i said let him start i am not against them let him do it but why don't you do it i said you produce children and i will look after you maharaj <laughs> is this world created by me no why should i worry then who will worry bhagwan himself says yada yada hi dharmasya glanir bhavati bharata abhyuttana madharmasya tadatmanam trujamyam paritranaya sadhunam vinashay cha duskrutam see he has created this world let him bother you relax see therefore this world is just an appearance on the substratum of सच्चिदानंद लक्षण परमात्मा दिस परमात्मा एज द सबस्टैटम ऑफ द वर्ल्ड इज इंडिकेटेड बाय द वर्ड पर शब्द न उच्चते सो परावर पर वी अंडरस्टूड नाउ सेकंड थिंग अंत अहमादी दृश्य विलक्षण 
अस्मत प्रत्ययालंबन भूत प्रत्यक्ष चिन्मात्र स्वरूप या साक्षाख्य जीवात्मा स एव अवरशब्देन उच्यते नाउ अंत विदिनास अहम आदि दृश्य विलक्षण आई एम द सीयर यू आर द सीन सो दृश्य विलक्षण आई एम अदर दैन यू सो दिस आय हु इज अदर दैन दि सीन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड एंड अस्पत प्रत्यय आलंबन भूता दैट विच इज अस्पत प्रत्यय अस्पत प्रत्यय मीन्स द नोशन ऑफ आयनेस आलंबन भूता प्रत्यक्ष चिन्मात्र स्वरूप एसेन्शियली चिन्मात्र प्युअर कॉन्शियसनेस स साक्षाख्य जीवात्मा सो प्रकृति एंड परमात्मा रिफ्लेक्टेड इन द प्रकृति टुगेदर इज कॉल्ड द जीवात्मा सो दिस जीवात्मा इज इंडिकेटेड बाय द वर्ड अवर शब्द न उच्चते टू थिंग देर फोर वन इज द सबस्टैटम ऑफ दिस वर्ल्ड इज पर and the jiva is the avara or upper only man is not husband then man with the limitations of the wife is called as a limited man is husband see if the wife disappears then the question comes what happens to the husband there was a couple married for 5 years and then he um was in a very happy go lucky type so she was very sentimental and very loving caring kind so she said let's go for a nice uh, Hide outs. He said, "What for? We are okay here. No, we are completed five years of our marriage. So, I want to ask you a question. What is the question? Question is, if I die, she says. Immediately he plugs her mouth. Don't say that. I will become mad. Okay." Another five years go. Again the same question. Now see, we are married for ten years. If I die, now don't plug my mouth. I know you will say you will get mad, but now I want some different answer. After ten years, if I die, will you get married? I won't get that mad. <laughs> Another five years gone. Fifteen years. Then again the same question, and he said, "I know your answer. You will not get that mad, but question is the same. I want to know your reaction. If I die, will you get married?" He said, "A mad person can do anything." <laughs> so the jiva. He is essentially a man, but he has mistaken himself to be the jiva. In the same manner, the jiva, Paramatma, expressing through the limitations of the prakriti, is called as the jiva. But if he is able to understand these prakritic limitations, they are not real. Reality is you, the divine. Who is miserable? His husband is miserable. man is never miserable husband is never happy parmatma is sachidananda jivatma is constantly complaining this is the meaning of the para and apara words in this ma mantra which i told you asprat pratyalambana bhuta pratyakshin matra swarupa yah sakshakya so the jiva is the parmatma although he is playing the role of the jiva see the husband is essentially a man although he is playing the role of a husband therefore what he has to do he has to only remember that he has to play this role that's it 
but we get rolled up in that road now who can help us and then our approach is oh god let me be happy as a husband bhagwan says this is called ashakya anushthanam <laughs> as somebody you will be always miserable as nobody you will be always happy are we not in deep sleep nobody in deep sleep who are we nobody therefore happy this is what bhagwan krishna said in bhagavad gita या निशा सर्वूता तस्या जागृति संयमी यस्याम जागृति भूता सा निशा पश्यतो मुने सी संयमी मीन्स द वन हु हैज परफेक्ट कंट्रोल ओवर इज माइंड विथ रेफरेंस टू टाइम स्पेस एंड ऑब्जेक्ट सच ए पर्सन इज अवेकन टू इज डिवाइन नेचर टू विच द इग्नरंट पीपल आर स्लीपिंग सी एंड टू दिस रिलेटिव वर्ल्ड टू विच the ignorant people are awakened to this relative world the wise man is sleeping see when the ladies go to buy the ornaments their attention is on the design the fashion the glitter see and the jewelers attention is on the gold both of them are seeing the same thing where is our attention wise people look at this world and call it as god we look at the god and call it as a world who can help us therefore aham anta aham aadi drishti vilakshana asmat pratyalambana bhutah pratyakshit matra rupa sa saksha kya jivatma sa eva avar shabdena uchyate now parascha asau avarascha iti paravarah pratyak abhinna paramatma so that we is both the para and the avar meaning that we is supporting the illusion of the world and that we is supporting the experiencer of this illusory world both of them are the same now to understand this don't go now but imagine you are in front of a mirror now what is our experience in front of a mirror we do not look at the mirror i am looking at this handkerchief but when i look in the mirror we look in the mirror we don't look at the mirror and then we don't look at the reflection we look at ourselves therefore this ammas when they go and stand in front of the mirror they take the dot com you can go in every house on every mirror there are many dot coms that mirror is avagyavati <laughs> and the old stuff they they will take it so when they take that dot com they don't put it on the mirror they put on themselves see in the same manner when we study the scriptures we are not reading the books we are reading ourselves okay. therefore objectivity is the biggest obstacle on the spiritual path recently maybe few months before there was a nobel prize awarded to three scientists in physics and for what it was given it was given for they have proved that this world is an illusion <laughs> without nobel <noble> prize <laughs> <laughs> see friends therefore the more we become aware of this <coughs> para and avar they are not two परश्च असौ अवरश्चे प्रत्येक अभिन्न परमात्मा सी मयि एव सकलम जातम एवरीथिंग इज बॉर्न इन मी मयि सर्व प्रतिष्ठित एवरीथिंग इज लिविंग इन मी मयि सर्व लयम याति एवरीथिंग गोज बैक टू मी तद ब्रह्मास्म वी अटेंड यू 
everything comes out of the deep sleep everything goes back to the deep sleep like in our dream there are so many people good people bad people they in the trees mountains rivers holy places unholy places everything is there in the dream be attentive when the dream breaks means when we become awake have we ever inquired and thought about what happened to those people in the dream over if this is clear we are all in the dream of brahma ji brahma ji is sleeping and we are in, in his dream and when brahma ji will wake up mahapralaya will he ever start thinking are that mahatma where he must have gone and that uh, dukhatma where he must have gone no our see is a vesti dream brahma ji hiranya garbha sutratma samasti dream so we are in the dream of a dreamer as a dreamed if you have studied yoga vashishta there is a story of uh, leela and saraswati to understand that the story take simple experiment keep two mirrors opposite each other there will be a reflection of this mirror in that mirror there will be a reflection of this mirror into that mirror then there will be a reflection in the reflection of the reflected mirror and it will go on 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 where are they all they appear but do not exist and therefore it is said parascha so avarascha iti parama paramaraha pratyak abhinna paramatma therefore don't push parmatma away from yourself then start playing parmatma parmatma means what parmatma supports health he also support the disease parmatma support the um, gain he also support the loss therefore sukha dukhe same krutva labha labho jaya jayo tato yuddha yo yujjasv नहीं बम पापम मवाप ससी लिव इन दिस वर्ल्ड इन सच ए मैनर डोंट क्रिएट फ्रेंड एन एनिमी लेट देर बी नो इम्प्रेशन फॉर्म्ड ऑन द माइंड बट वेन वी लिसन टू सत्संग लाइक द क्यूलोमीश स्टूडेंट हाँ आई अंडरस्टूड वेरी वेल द टीचर आई शू स्कूल डिव यदि मन्ने से सुबह देती दहर में वापी नूनम तम व्यक्त ब्रह्मण रूपम If you think you understood well, you understood nothing, because we told you the truth is beyond the scope of your intelligence, and yet we understand. See, friends. Therefore, parascha so avarascha para paravara pratyek abhinna paramatma taspin eva antar bahischa para rupe na apar rupe na cha avastite paramartha dham paravara vibhag rahite pratyek abhinne paravare brahmani. तुम वा अहम अस्मी यदि भगवो देवते अहम वै दोमसी श्रुत्युसारेण अहम ब्रह्मास्मी ब्रह्मवाहमस्मी व्यतिहारेण अखंडकन साक्षात् सती इन दिस मैनर वेन वी हैव एव तस्मिन एवं सती दिस बीइंग सो व्हाट बीइंग सो द वर्ल्ड विच इज सपोर्टेड विच इज अवर ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस इज ऑल्सो परमात्मा the one who is experiencing the world through the various faculties he is also the parmatma so parmatma looking at parmatma be attentive we can have desire about something which is recognized by us other than ourselves we can never have desire about ourselves because we are we and therefore he who has this abidance in the absolute he is free from all the desires no desires then what is the life 
Life is a time pass. Will the fragrance have an arrogance that I give fragrance to all the people? No. If somebody takes, wonderful. If nobody takes, super wonderful. Because the flower does not know that I have a fragrance. Is known by others. In the same manner, Bhagavan Ravana Maharshi did not go here and there. His fragrance pulled the people around him. See, my friends. Therefore, Paravare Brahmani Tumva Masmiti Bhagavad Devate. Therefore, as much I am divine, that much you are divine. Therefore, Aham Brahmasme Brahma Vaham Asmiti Vati Rane Akhandaikar Satvena Sakshat Krute Sati. See, therefore, there is but one unbroken, conscious, blissful existence, Tena Paravara Brahma Sakshat Karena, by this experience, that the experiencer and the experienced, they are one and the same. Asya Paravara Brahma Sakshara Krutavata Mama. This is what I have now come to experience. Mama, Hrude Granthi Bheda Sarva Samshaya Nivrutti Sarva Karma Kshay Rupa Parama Purushartaha Samyak Avir Bhuyar. In Mundoko Upanishad, this mantra comes. Three things. Vidyate Hrude Granthi. Chidyante sarva samshayaha, kshiyante chasya karmani, tasmin drushte paravare. This is the meaning of that paravare. So what are the signs that we are abiding in the truth? These are the three signs. See? What are the signs of corona? Keep your mouth shut. <laughs> that is Corona. Corona means don't do. No lectures. So, what are the signs of abidance in this absolute reality? First, Vidyate Hrudaya Granthi. The knot of the heart is undone. See, this word Bheda is Many a time mistakenly understood. Like they use this word in Chakra Bheda, in the Kundalini Marga, they use the Mooladhara Chakra Bheda, then Swadhisthana Chakra Bheda, then Manipura Chakra Bheda, then the Anahata Chakra Bheda, then the Vishuddha Chakra Bheda, then the Agya Chakra Bheda, Sastra Chakra Bheda. Bheda means piercing and opening. That is not the meaning. Bheda means secret. What is the secret of your beauty? I take life boy shake in the morning. <laughs> Bheda secret. So, Vidyate Hrudaya Granthi. Hrudaya Granthi, Bheda is understood. What is the secret? Secret is Avidya, Kama, Karma, these three things put together is Hrudaya Granthi. Avidya, what is Avidya? Avidya is a sense of incompleteness. Because there is a sense of incompleteness, one cause, one reason. Second, sense of otherness, second reason. Third reason, we go on projecting and imagining. If I get that object, I will be happy. Without that object, I am unhappy. That object is the source of happiness. And therefore, I must have happiness. I must have that object. Now tell me, an intelligent, highly educated, well-placed, earning a lot, free, happy boy, why should he think of getting married? What a life without a wife. Virus has entered. Gets married. Thereafter, what a life because of the wife. <laughs> then what to do? Then go to 
आत्मविद्या मंदिर Now where from it started avidya, ignorance, that I am incomplete without wife. Then you get her. So avidya. Now the second thing is a sense of otherness. I cannot have desire about my uh, phone because I already have mine. It is mine. we cannot have a desire of that which is recognized as our own see so two things are involved sense of incompleteness and sense of otherness in these two factors are involved it is called as the hrudaya granthi now what is the result or the impact of this hrudaya granthi the impact is a sense of incompleteness and therefore the mind start projecting if i get that object i will be complete and happy so he gets married and he is completely miserable <coughs> now see in deep sleep we have no sense of incompleteness because we are nobody in deep sleep there is no sense of otherness in the absence of these two sense of otherness and sense of incompleteness there cannot be any desire and therefore in deep sleep we are happy see that is why we all want to go to sleep even in satsang so hrudaya granthi is what this is the hrudaya granthi the ignorance about ourselves and about the world so vidyate hrudaya chidyante sarva samshaya the second place where we get caught up in our life is samshaya doubt is there something like brahman if brahman is all pervading why i am not experiencing it like heat is all pervading i can experience it light is all pervading i can experience it but if brahman is all pervading why can't i express i doubt there is anything called a brahman chidyante sarva samshaya then kshiyante cha asya karmani there will be no sense of doership in life see friends these are the three bondages at the body level karma at the mind level desire at the intellect level wrong notions these wrong notions are corrected see the moment this is corrected desires will disappear from the mind when there is no desire there is nothing to do no where to go that is why our maha mantra will really relieve you from all the your uh, worldly problems other mantras you keep on doing without understanding any ओम द्रमकम यजामहे सुगंधिम मुष्टिवर्धनम उर्वारुकम यवनारुद्रम ओम द्रमकम यजामहे ओम एंड यू विल सी दिस पंडित जी व्हेन दे डू द पूजा दे आर नॉट ऑफरिंग द फ्लावर्स विद ग्रेट लव ओम शिवाय नमः ओम वषटकाराय नमः ओम शिवाय नमः एंड शिव जी इज होल्डिंग लाइक दिस He told me <laughs> when these people do puja, I have to catch it. <laughs> Mantra without meaning is a noise. 
while talking to you, suppose in between, and thereafter, <laughs> what you will say? Why has Swami Dhyas made this stupid noise? Because this has no meaning. In the same manner, Om Trambakam Yajamahe Sugandhim Pushtivardhanam A quickly R. Om Trambakam Yajamahe Sugandhim Pushtivardhanam Urvarukam Yovannanar Pratyor Mukshi Yamam Radhata We chant every day. But is anything happening? Because the meaning is not known. See? So somebody comes and tells me in Sanskrit, which I don't understand. He comes and tells that I really love you. I don't understand. So I remain indifferent. And if somebody comes and tells me in the language which I understand, he tells me that you are dumb. Because I understand the meaning, I will react. See, therefore, these mantras must make a sense to us. Otherwise, it becomes only a ritual. Kshiyante chasya karmani Tasmin drushte paravare So this is what is called Bhrude granti bhedaha Sarva samshaya nivrutti Now there is no doubt about spiritual practice. Be attentive. There is no doubt about the following wrong notions. First notion about ourselves. Who are we? Second notion about the world. What is this world is? The third notion is about God. Where is He? What is He? And the fourth notion is the spiritual practice. Unless these four wrong notions are corrected, ande naiva niyamana yathandha avidyaya mantare vartamana svayam dhiraha panditam manyamana Dandramyamana Pariyanti Mudha Andhe Naiva Niyamana Yathanda One blind leading the other blind. Observe this thing in the world. If somebody is blind and if he touches other person, he will never accept or think that he is not blind. He will think that he is not blind, he is normal. So, one blind man touch the other person, imagining he is not blind. Therefore, he said, Hey man, I am blind, I can't see. Can you cross me the road? Now that second blind man, why will he say, tell that I am also blind? Okay, hold on. One blind fellow leading the other blind fellow. But, be attentive. A person who is deaf, he thinks everybody is deaf. Observe this thing. A blind person never thinks the other person is blind. But a deaf person always thinks others are uh, deaf. And therefore they talk very loudly. No, you should be able to hear. Because I am deaf, everybody is deaf. These are funny things in this world. Discover and be happy. Prudeya granti bheda samshaya nivrutti sarva karmakshe rupa parama purushartha samyak avir bhuyat. This is the parama purushartha. 2021 Ekatva Brahma Nivrutti Rupoyam Granti Bheda Drudhi Bhuya Of this Ahankar Ekatva Brahma Nivrutti Rupa. We have this notion that I is a Vyakti, a individuality. See, all the spiritual practice is to discard the Vyakti and enter the Abhivyakti. Vyakti is individuality. Abhivyakti is a manifestation. Now to understand this, Tube lights and bulbs are many. Therefore, they are Vyakti individuality. But in all of them, light principle is the same. So, light is Abhivyakti and tube lights are Vyakti. Where our attention goes? 
to the multiplicity, the many names of the tubes. Our attention doesn't go to the light. And you go still further. Is this light also a reality? When the tube light or the bulb becomes fused, is anything lost? Nothing is lost. Because electricity is still there. In the same manner, Paramatma expressing through tube lights that we are. <laughs> Many tube lights. <laughs> and in these tube lights, there are there is light of life. So light wise, all tube lights are one. But tube light wise, they are different. Life wise, we are all one. See? Kama, Krodha, Loba, Moha, Joy, Sorrows, Hunger, Desire, Frustration, Jealousy. Common to everyone. Like this light is common in all the tube lights. See? But where we are lost, we are lost on the tube lights. We are lost on the bulbs. And when our identification with the bulb is gone, if the body is gone, then life continues to be. This is what is mentioned here. Ahankarat manoho ekatva brahma nivrutti rupa. See, that I am separate from you, you are separate from me. This brahma nivrutti rupa, I am gamti bhedaha drudi bhuyad. Sense of otherness is an illusion. See, if I have to get myself operated, heart operation for example. One lady blessed me in Bombay. Swamiji, you will never have heart, heart problem. I said, thank you, Mama. What thank you? I am angry with you. So why? What happened? You have no heart. Oh, thank you. So if I have to, get my heart operated, will I check the gotra of the doctor? Doctor, do you have a chandilya gotra? No. No. We see the capacity of that particular doctor in the same manner. When we talk to each other, Brahmana, Kshatriya, Vaishya, Shudra, this gotra, that gotra, Ram, 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 Ram. Why not look at the whole world as a great play of the divine and we are also one object of play. Enjoy life. Both things are essential in life. Health is essential, disease is essential. Gain is required and uh, loss is required. I should not have any misery in life. Then only one option, die then you will not have misery either. And all those who are becoming miserable because of you, they will be also happy. Yeah. Now after the body is dead, it is kept on the fire, and the fire is lit, will the fire, body say, hey, it's too hot, yeah. <laughs> no. So, pain is a sign of life. Good. If you don't have pain, then you are dead. Therefore, ahankaratmano ekatva brahma nivrti rupoyam granthi bhedaha drudi bhuyar bhuyar. This, this is the granthi. We are considering ourselves to be separate from others. No. This we have to clearly understand. We are but one. See? And if we start practicing this, what will happen is that Topic of first two mantras of Isha Vasya Upanishad. See, for example, Isha Vasya Vidam Sarvam Jatkinta Jagatyam Jagat. This is a vision given. When this vision is adopted by us, then Tena Tyaktena Bhunjita. We will not get lost ourselves in Bhoga, but we will protect ourselves from ourselves. Tena Tyaktena Bhunjita. Maa Gurudha Kasya Siddhanam Kasya Paramatmanaha. Everything belongs to Him. But we keep on accumulating the things. So accumulation and uh, the dry kachra will be over. 
then does it mean life will be a boredom? Because no indulgence, no bhoga, no collecting money, not working. Yes, God is everywhere and lie down like a buffalo. No. Then, Kurvan neve hakaramani jiji visheshatakam sama. Live every moment of your life 100%. If you see the normal translations, it is written there. Uh, doing your duties, you should desire to live for a hundred years. I am not in favor of that translation. Bhagavan has not to say this. What he says, Kurvan neveha karmani, never retire in life. See? Jiji visheshatakam sama. Live every moment hundred years, hundred percent. Instead of adding years to your life, add life to your every moment. That is our Maha Mantra. Wherever you are, whenever you are, whatever you are, be hundred percent. You have understood Isha Vasya Upanishad. Otherwise, Mera Moodi Ni Lagra, I don't feel like living. There is a railway track there. <laughs> They depress people. They are their own enemies. You see in the Western world as many depressed people are there. They are not so much in India. One lady in one of my international yoga conference, after the talk was over, she said, I am writing a book on mind. So I want to get some input from you. And But now I have to catch my flight. I will call you from US. He said, okay. She called India, it was 2 o'clock. I said, at night I am otherwise, so I cannot talk to you. <laughs> so I slept. Next day she called when it was day in India. She said, I want to know what is the approach to mind according to the Western and the Eastern approach according to your yoga. That is what is my topic I want to write in my book. I said, listen, I will tell you both in one, one line. In Western uh, thought, what are the unhealthy conditions of the mind and how we can encash it for earning money is the approach to mind according to the Western approach. In India, in our Yoga Shastra, the approach is what are the dormant infinite potentialities in every mind, how they can be invoked. But I said, my topic is over. Put on. <laughs> Health is only one. Diseases are many. See, friends, therefore, these wrong notions are the problem. They should be removed. And this is another very beautiful mantra. All our doubts are taken here. Atma deha divacharikto vanava. Vetirikthatvepi kartrutvadi dharma yogi vanava. Akartrutvepi tasya brahmana bhedosthi vanava. Abhedepi tas jnanam karmadi sahitam vanava. Va mukti sadhakam kevalam va. Va mukti sadhakam kevalam va. Tathapi atma sakshi va. Tathapi atma sakshi va. Kartava. Kartava. Sakshitvepi asya brahmatva masti vanava. Sakshitvepi asya brahmatva masti vanava. tad buddhya viditum shakyate vanava. Brahmatve satyapi tad buddhya Ashakyatve pitad vedana matrena mukti rasti vanava. Chant together. Sakshat krute pi itaha. Param kartavya masti vanava. Param kartavya masti vanava. Kartavya bhavepi. 
जीवन मुक्तिरस्ति वानवा जीवन मुक्तिरस्ति वानवा जीवन मुक्तत्वेपी जीवन मुक्तत्वेपी वर्तमान देह वर्तमान देह पातांतरम विदेह मुक्ति पातांतरम विदेह मुक्ति भविष्यति वानवा भविष्यति वानवा तत् प्राप्तो अपि तत् प्राप्तो अपि कालांतरे कालांतरे पुनर्जन्म भविष्यति वानवा पुनर्जन्म भविष्यति वानवा इत्यादि सर्व इत्यादि सर्व समस्य निवृत्तिर भूयार These are the doubts that we carry on our head. This way or that way. This way, vana va. This way or that way. So, atma deha di vidhirikto vana va. Whether the atma, the self, is other than the body or he is the body. Question number one. Then, vidhirikteveti vidhirikteveti. कर्तृत्वा दी धर्म योगी वानवा इफ ही इज अदर दैन द बॉडी देन डज ही हैव द कर्तृत्वाभिमान और नो अकर्तृत्व पी इफ ही डजेंट हैव कर्तृत्वाभिमान तस् भ्रमण भेदो अस्ति वानवा इफ ही इज नॉट हैविंग कर्तृत्वाभिमान देन इज ही अदर दैन द ब्रह्मन और नॉट अभेदेपी इफ ही इज नॉट सेपरेट फ्रॉम ब्रह्मन देन तज्ञानम कर्मादि सहितम वानव वा मुक्ति साधनम केवलम वा सो इफ ही हैज रेकग्नाइज हिम सेल्फ टू बी अदर दैन द ब्रह्मन देन विल ही कंटिन्यू टू डू द कर्म एंड देन विल इट बिकम द मीन्स ऑफ लिबरेशन तथा आत्मा साक्षी कर्ता वा न वा इन दैट केस विल द आत्मा इज द साक्षी विटनेस और नॉट साक्षित्वेपी अस्य ब्रह्मत्वमस्ति वा न वा इफ इज ए साक्षी चैतन्य वेद दैट टाइम ही इज ब्रह्मन और नॉट ब्रह्मत्वे सत्यपी तद्बुद्ध्या वेदि शक्यते वा न वा इफ ही इज ब्रह्मन इज ही एबल टू नो बाय हिज इंटलेक्ट दैट ही इज ब्रह्मन और नॉट शक्यवे अभी तेदनमात्रेण मुक्तिरस्ति वा न वा सपोज ही नोज दैट ही इज ब्रह्मन बाय दिस नॉलेज ओनली इज ही लिबरेटेड और नॉट साक्षात कृते इत पर कर्तव्यमस्ति वा न वा इफ ही हैज कम टू रियलाइज दि अहम ब्रह्मास्मी इज ए लेफ्ट विथ एनी डुअरशिप कर्तव्य और नॉट देह कर्तव्या भावे पी इदानी मम जीवन मुक्ति अस्ति वा न वा इफ आई हैव नो ड्यूटी नो कर्तव्य देन एम आई लिबरेटेड और नॉट जीवन मुक्त वे पी इफ आई एम जीवन मुक्त लिबरेटेड भैल अलायु दे वर्तमान देह पातांतर विदेह मुक्ति भविष्य वा न वा इफ आई एम जीवन मुक्त एंड दिस बॉडी फॉल्स विल आई बिकम विदेह मुक्त और नॉट एंड तत् प्राप्त अभी कालांतरे पुनर्जन्म भविष्य वा न वा एंड सपोज आई लीव दिस बॉडी एंड देर आफ्टर नाउ बिकॉज आई एम लिबरेटेड आफ्टर द फॉल ऑफ द बॉडी विदेह मुक्ति बट वील आई अगेन बी बॉर्न इन दिस वर्ल्ड और नॉट इति सर्व संशय निवृत्तिर्भूयात हाउ मेनी डाउट्स आर ऑल दिस डाउट्स आर इन अवर है Suppose I come to realize, so I mean, what will happen? When I was reading this, I was thinking, how can such doubts come? But then all of you help me. <laughs> Therefore, you are all my gurus. I have learned from you. So, I mean, please don't mind and don't uh, tell my example to others. Okay. What it is like? realization i said you get a kind of thrill <laughs> realization and then you start getting some kind of imaginary fish <laughs> what realization all happening will stop when you come to realize that you are the space what will be that experience 
work on this this is called the the uh, the akasha traya sadhana three spaces bhuta akash chitta akash and chida akash for sadhana is this what it is like being space don't say i am space no what must be the experience of the space work on it then we don't ask anybody we ourselves come to know space supports the remaining four elements doesn't oppose anything doesn't get influenced by anything whether more elements are added it is not a burden for the space if some elements are removed it is not loss for the space so what will be the your meditation or spiritual practice play space space what it is like being space without doing anything you are one with yourself then we come to the second stage the chitta akash mind space as the gross space has got the gross objects the mind space has got the thoughts as the objects so when we are playing the mind space then any thought will not disturb us we will not insist we will not be obliged uh, obsess with a particular quality of thought let any thought come and go who cares then we come to chidakash whether there is a joy a joyful personality is not born whether there is a misery a miserable personality is not born the chida akasha is an experience without the birth of an experience of so all the sarva samshay nivrutir bhuyat all the samshay doubts will be over play only these three techniques i am telling you play when you play there is no reason to succeed or failure on the contrary on the spiritual path there is never a failure if we have learned from every experience of our life if we don't learn from our experience of life then we are utter failure therefore sarva samshaya nivrutti bhuyat let all the doubts be removed for good that was 22nd now 23rd one hour over okay we'll read and then see you next time अनारब्धानाम आगामी जन्म हेतु निवृत्तिपूर्णमदूर्णमित पूर्णमादाय पूर्णमेवशिष्यते ओं शांति 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 हरि ओ श्री गुरुभ्यो नम हरि